She is known for her extensive stage career, having starred in numerous productions across the country. She is also recognized for her successful transition from stage to film, having appeared in over 50 Hollywood movies. Her name is Mina Gombel. In the golden age of Hollywood, there was one actress who captured the hearts of audiences with her talent and charm, Mina Gombel. Born Winifred Lee, she embarked on a successful stage career in the early 1900s, starring in various theaters across the country. From Albany to Los Angeles, Gombel made a name for herself with her captivating performances. But it wasn't until the late 1920s that Gombel's star truly began to rise. She caught the attention of the Fox Film Corporation and was signed on as an actress. Her first film, Doctor's Wives, marked the beginning of her illustrious career in the world of cinema. Initially using the stage name Nancy Gardner, Gombel quickly made a name for herself as a talented and versatile actress. Over the course of her career, Gombel appeared in around 50 Hollywood films, showcasing her range in talent. From comedies like Blockheads and The Thin Man to dramas like The Best Years of Our Lives, Gombel effortlessly brought characters to life on the silver screen. Her performances were praised for their depth and authenticity, and she quickly became a sought-after actress in the industry. Mina Gombel's impact and legacy in the world of entertainment cannot be understated. Her stage and film career spanned several decades, and she left an indelible mark on the industry. Her talent and dedication to her craft continue to inspire aspiring actors and actresses to this day. Mina Gombel, known for her talent and beauty, had a personal life that often captivated the public's attention. She was no stranger to matrimony, having been married multiple times throughout her life. Her first marriage took place on March 9, 1916, in New York City when she tied the knot with Howard Chesham Rumsey. However, their union did not stand the test of time, and they divorced in 1921. It was a difficult period for Minna, but she remained resilient and determined to find happiness. In 1922, Minna found herself entangled in a secret marriage with aviator and press agent Ferdinand Egana in Atlanta, Georgia. The secrecy was short-lived, as Egana's arrest for fraud in November exposed their relationship to the public. Unwilling to continue in a marriage tainted by scandal, Minna filed for divorce the following month, which was finalized in 1924. But Minna's pursuit of love did not waver. On May 19, 1933, she walked down the aisle for the third time, this time with millionaire banker Joseph W. Sefton Jr. Their marriage seemed promising, but after 14 years of marriage, they decided to separate in 1947. Eventually, they officially divorced in 1954. There were rumors surrounding Minna's involvement with writer-slash-producer Myron C. Fagan during the 1920s. Some sources claimed that they were married, but it was later revealed that Fagan was actually married to another woman during that period. This revelation debunked the notion of Minna's marriage to Fagan and added another layer of complexity to her personal life. Sadly, Minna's journey came to an end on April 14, 1973, when she passed away in Santa Monica. Her final resting place is in Loudoun Park Cemetery in Baltimore, Maryland, where she was laid to rest. Minna Gombel's personal life was filled with ups and downs, with marriages that brought both joy and heartache. Through it all, she remained a resilient and talented actress, leaving behind a legacy that continues to be celebrated to this day. Do you want to explore more actors? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.